What's up, guys? Hope everybody's having a great day. So Canelo Alvarez had said this to Kamal Usman, saying, you calling me out, right? You want the payday, right? So you know where, but sit down. It's not your turn yet. I have a legacy to make. Well, Kamal Usman responded, saying, enough said. You don't want that smoke in a real fight. I hear you. Good luck, champ. Steven Espinosa said, laugh out loud, UFC fighters want that boxing paycheck, but don't understand that boxers have the autonomy to choose opponents. It's not about not wanting quote-unquote smoke, it's about professional self-determination, a foreign concept to those who let the kickboxing instructor choose their fights. Kamal Usman responded saying, boxing is a beautiful quote-unquote art with some amazing athletes and even a couple of good promoters. The problem is low lives like you that are around the sport that have destroyed it for everyone. Take notes from what Dana has done. Kamar Usman also said our fans know who the best is because the best fight the best. Not run and hide and fight nobodies with plastic belts and call themselves super champions. Keep quiet next time and if you need lessons on how to save that dying sport, let me know I've got Dana on speed dial. Jake Paul steps in and says Kamar Usman, boxing is dying. Also Kamar Usman, please Canelo fight me for a payday. Kamar Usman replied saying, you're really good at this internet tough guy stuff. I give you that. Two questions for you. One, you and me locked in a room who makes it out alive. Two, Saul and I locked in a room who makes it out alive. I like your energy though. Jake Paul responded saying, you and me locked in a room together? Sounds like a good time to me. I'll bring the fuzzy handcuffs. Jake Paul so tweeted out he's going to be back August 13th, so people are speculating who he's going to be going against. Let me know how you guys feel about this exchange in words. Guys, have a great day. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you guys on the next one.